Hey there! I hope you're doing well. So, um, I have some hot water. It's not that much, just a little bit. So, mm. really good with some hot water. If you haven't tried it, I recommend trying drinking hot water. No sugar, no coffee, just, just hotter water. Sometimes it's good to try new things. So, today we pushed out the uh, Notion Tonki version uh, 0 to 18. And um, one of the new features is that you can group close deletions. So um, let me actually go to a Notion page here. Here we have an empty Notion page. Capitals in Europe. And you already know that you can use close deletions, right? So you can say that the capital in Norway is Oslo, right? Just use the shortcut, bam, you have a closed deletion. What if you had more, like um, the national, if I can write, the national day is on the 17th of May, and you make that um, closed deletion, right, like this. So this is going to generate uh, one closed deletion in Anki, like C1, C2, and C3. If you don't know what that means, that means just card 1, card 2, and card 3. So this is what Notion to Anki also does. It's 1, 2, and 3. But if you wanted to group them, right, you want to see things together. For example, here, you want to group um, Norway and 17th of May because it's a national day and you want to memorize them together, you can just go here with the emoji picker and then find um, the number. And I, this might be different on Windows, so um, just look up the platform specifics. And I'll have links in the description, so pick this one. And um, I'm just gonna leave the this one empty because then it's gonna get the next value by default, which in this case is two. So here I'm just gonna add one. So What's going to happen, like if I move this here, you can see this one gets C1, C2, C3. Here we get C1, C1, right? And then here, the Oslo gets C2. And then we have the last one, which gets C1. So you can use up to um, 10. So you have uh, all of these emojis, right? So this, again, will look different depending on your operating system. But uh, if we if you browse your emoji picker, you should be able to see that there are numbers from zero to ten. We only support one to ten for now. So uh, yeah, let's take a look at uh, how this is going to look in Anki. And I, I like cleaning up my uh, pages before I export. So again, remember it's HTML. So export and capitals in Europe. And there was a typo there, but that's fine. And then I'm going to upload this. You know the drill, right, by now. And no need to do anything there. You just uh, convert. And then download. And let's open up an Anki. And you, or actually, you can see it here even. So if you see here, um, it's very subtle. You can see C1, card 1, C2, and here at the right side, you can see the last one on the top has a C3, card 3, right? But the bottom one has a C1, and that's because we group them together. So let's take a look at how this looks like in Anki. So I'm going to go here in the browse, and you can see if I go into full screen mode and preview, you can see these two values are grouped, right? Because we use the number 1. And that's how you... Um, group close deletions in Ocean Donkey. This uh, was a feature that someone suggested on the Patreon. So I, I listen to you guys and I try to uh, try to address stuff when it makes sense. We want to keep Notion to Anki simple. So if you have any other suggestions, feature ideas, just s let me know. And um, for the next week, we're probably going to focus on closed deletions again, I think. There is another bug which you can read about in the, in the post that's coming. Or maybe you've already read it. So anyways, uh, thanks for watching and um, let me know um, what you think of this.